and Sachin Tendulkar have something in common? Sachin Tendulkar, before starting his career, was a ball boy. I don't know whether you know this or not. And you being the ball girl in the World Cup final, which was held at Eden Gardens. So, how did it all start? Because if I go 20, 25 years back, there, that was a time where cricket was not that famous, especially in the girls sector. So, what made you be into it? Well, you know, uh, I was just young that time. 1997 World Cup was happening in India. And uh, I was just fortunate girl to get some ticket for those matches. And I was not 100% aware of that the uh, World Cup was happening and the girls are playing. And some of of uh, government of West Bengal, uh, sports authority of government of West Bengal sent few complimentary ticket across nearby uh, Kolkata, few girls schools. So somehow, you know, as a, as a sporty girl, uh, you know, people know you as a, as a student was a very bad, but uh, as, as a sports person and, uh, you know, everybody know me as a, you know, she is a crazy about sports. So, so that's why I just got ticket and fortunately that day my parents my dad was accept me to take me there because otherwise it's, it, it is not going to be so easy for me to go there and you know uh, uh, watch uh, that match because Kolkata is quite far from my village so right. uh, fortunately my dad uh, uh, took me that day and somehow I just uh, just and that was my first time I'm going to Eden Garden and uh, uh, I was just standing in the front of the uh, main gate of uh, Cricket Association of Bengal and somebody asked me, you are a ball girl, come inside and I said, okay, okay. and Papa said, okay, I'll t- meet you there after the match over here only I said, okay, I, mean, I just go inside and I, I don't know anything about that I was just uh, wore, wore one t-shirt, they just give me one t-shirt as a ball girl uh, t-shirt there is some sponsor name, I'm not sure about the name at this moment, I just wore the t-shirt and sat down one place and I watched entire the match sitting there as a ball girl and that is how I just watched that match and it was it was extremely uh, uh, you know, uh, proudest moment in my life because watching that match you know, you, you used to play the same sport with the boys hearing a lot of criticism, a lot of hard comment from them and then you are uh, watching uh, uh, Australia and New Zealand playing final match with the competitiveness almost full house Eden Garden Most yeah. uh, also mostly uh, those are girls because they have given a lot of complimentary passes to across the, uh, Kolkata nearby Kolkata uh, all the girls schools to get, watch come and watch uh, that match so yeah there was a plenty of crowd but the uh, main thing was you know, sitting there watching uh, Australia New Zealand girls are playing and competitiveness and that day I realized if I start playing these sports, I have to play for my country one day. And then I realized that this, that made do in my life. Because before that, I never have any kind of idea that, uh, you know, uh, where girls is play, what is the uh, 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 status of women's cricket in India. Then I slowly, right. slowly try to follow a lot of things, a lot of questions have arise me. And then I I, I uh, start uh, preparing myself and playing with the leather ball. Earlier I used to play it with the tennis ball. With the, you know I think you also played in the backyard with a uh, when I was small uh, when you were young. Uh, still you were young. So we all played a little bit of cricket with the tennis ball in the backyard. So I yeah. used to do that same thing, but uh, never played w- with the leather ball. The first time I saw white ball in that match, and uh, yeah, I think. After after a certain time, you know, I realized that this is the thing I want to do in my life. And yeah, it was not easy, you know, coming from middle class family and, uh, you know, explaining to your family when, when you are about to give your first board exam and you are taking some um, decision that where you have to decide either you want to play or you want to study. Because if you are staying in a chakta, it's not going to be easy for you to come and uh, you know uh, practice because there is no hardly any practice facilities those days used to be there. So I have to travel almost each and every day to Calcutta for training. So who is going to take you there and you are going to miss out your school, your uh, coaching. So it was huge kind of gambling for my side. But uh, honestly speaking, my family did not allow me to do that initially. It was real challenge for me to fight with them. Uh, you know, each and every day I fought with them you know it was not easy but in some some uh, after six seven months eight months I think they understand and they understand one thing was happened that my coach come to my house and he explained 
to okay. him and then he said that give me two years and uh, if she did not uh, select you know on a bengal team then she'll back and play uh, you know do your you know study she will not come to the ground then i'm not going to allow her to to come to the ground so somehow my uh, uh, parents also take that uh, uh, you know ga- they also take that gambling right. and uh, so i think end of the day that space and uh, yeah it's worth it it's it's worth it yeah, yeah absolutely absolutely i hope i have taken that decision I, and and i'm glad that 97 world cup ticket has come to my school no, and unfortunately uh, esteem don't you think it's all destiny things which are meant to happen may happen absolutely 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 because i, I mean uh, that's uh, i think four ticket has come to my uh, um, uh, school and out of four only two person have gone to the ground that's me and my dad and yeah. the other those those two ticket they just been in a uh, in a school and the school people knows only one person can go to the uh, uh, a uh, ground that uh, she is going to be there uh, so not not other other person will going to have any kind of interest go there and watch women's world cup final yeah. so so and i think i was i was fortunate uh, you you went there as a spectator eventually became a ball girl it's it's yeah, absolutely. absolutely it's absolutely wow absolutely yeah